Hello and welcome to Soft Expert. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a freelance marketplace website just like Fiverr and Upwork using Wallface. And we will be using Sofiri Wallface theme, which has all the functionalities that a freelance marketplace website needs. And it's also compatible with Elementor, using which we can create and customize the website just by drag and drop without any coding. And as admin and website owner, how you can make money with this website is you can charge by any sales on this website. So you can list feature job, you can charge extra for that. And I'll show you how you can make money with this website later on in this video. And before creating the website, let me show you a quick demo of the website that we will be creating in this video. Obviously, this team has lots of demos available that you can pick based on your needs. This is one of the demos. As you can see, we have a logo, the navigation, and login and register, and then job post. So this is home page one, and as you can see, we have lots of demos available for the home page only. Then we have many demos available for this job listing, for the employers, candidates, blog pages, and other pages like shop pricing, about contact, and so on. Now I'll explore a few of these pages to show you and give you the idea about the theme. You can go to the link in the description and you can explore all these pages. And this is the first one as you can see. Let me just refresh this. You can notice the animations, the hover effects. And then we have a powerful search bar where we can search for a job title based on a specific location. If I scroll down, this is popular job categories. So here you can display the job categories. Then we have feature jobs. So as I said, you can charge extra for featuring a job on the home page. And then we have a call to action to all the jobs. And then we have testimonials. So this is basically a slider and uh, some logos and a board section, some statistic news articles like blog posts and uh, this section for a mobile app, a call to action and a footer. You can customize this website based on your needs and you can explore all these demos and you can pick the one that you need. Now, this is another page in this, which is for the job listing. Here again, we have a search bar based on location and on categories. And then we have job types. So here we can filter the job based on salaries, experience, career level, and so on. And these are the job listings. So freelancer can open any of these. This is the job detail page. So you can see the job description the job board view and photos videos about the employer who posted this job and uh, some recent jobs also and if a freelancer is capable to do this they can just apply here so click on apply now they will be able to apply for this job this is another page for employers so here you will find a list of the employers like the buyers who can force the job so again you can search for a specific company based on a location and radius around you like the map and uh, category wise so all these are related to these companies who can post the job then we have this candidate page so basically these are freelancers and uh, you can search for freelancer on a specific keyword location category and so on and again there are multiple looks available for this also you can also have a grid version like this one so this is now a grid and if you want to open up any of these you can just click on view profile and here you can learn more about this freelancer like the name the skills you can even download their cv about the candidate location overview experience gender age and so on you can even access their social profiles their cv and you can contact them and so on so you can notice the theme is in much detail and can cover everything you need. And the last page is about a shop. So if you want to sell some products on this website, you can also have a shop page. This is compatible with WooCommerce also. And let's also see a dashboard. So if you want to test that, you can click on login and register. And you can log in with the demo accounts here. So let's try login with the candidate account. And we'll click login. You can also log in with Facebook, Google and so on. Login successful. Now this will take me to the dashboard. And now this is a candidate dashboard where a candidate can manage his profile. And this particular candidate has applied for 5 jobs, have 22 reviews, this much views and shortlists for 3 jobs and so on. This candidate can manage his profile here, his resume for the jobs applied and so on. Even messages can be managed from this dashboard so an employer and candidate can talk to each other using the built-in messaging system here. This will not work in the demo as you can see here. 
but this will work once we import this demo so a container can also manage meetings can change password can delete the file and can log out and the same way you can also check the employer dashboard so again this is a complete solution for a freelance marketplace website and in this video i will not cover everything in detail but i'll show you how you can get this theme and then how you can set up this theme with the demo content and after that this will be super easy to customize you can just upload your own logo you can keep the pages that you need and the rest of the functionalities will be ready for you in the demo so let's see how we can get this theme and how we can set this up so to get the theme you can just go to the link in the description which will take you to this page here you can see superior job board with theme this is the price and if you scroll down you will learn more about this as you can see we have 7 plus demos available and this is an all-in-one job board with theme with 17 plus home page demos and we have all these packages like job with map, multiple dashboards, a fly without login and so on front-end dashboards and so on and as I said this is compatible with Elementor so we will be able to make changes to the website easily so to get this theme you can just add this to cart and then go to checkout and here choose your payment method so you can pay with Visa, Mastercard, Paypal or Skrill so I'll put my card details and will click pay securely and you can see payment complete now we can download this theme so you can go to your downloads page or you can just scroll down here you will find the theme so click on download and this will start downloading the theme one more thing is you will also need its purchase code so for that you can go to downloads page where you will see all your themes just click on download here and click on license and purchase code you can download this so you will also get a file like this and now let's wait for this and then we will upload this to our workspace so let me log into my workspace dashboard now I am in the dashboard here you can see we don't have any plugins installed and we are using the default theme so and now I am in the dashboard as you can see we don't have any plugins installed and uh, if I go to appearance and themes we have this DB theme but we will replace this with the theme that we are currently bought so in this particular file you will get guides licensing plugins and this theme and its style theme so the first thing is you will have to extract this file like this and now we can upload the main theme in the child theme to our world face so for that i'll click add new here upload theme choose file and we'll select that file so first we will choose the main theme open install now so this was our main theme and now let's also upload the child theme so for that we'll go back to themes add new we'll choose file and we'll choose superior child theme then install now and this is a best practice to use a child theme because if you are making changes to the code this will not affect the main theme now we have successfully installed this one so let's activate this and just like other premium themes this will give you a notice about installing plugins so just click on begin installing plugins then select all click bulk action install and apply this will start installing the plugins so let's wait for this and then go back to plugin installer select all and choose activate and the following plugins were activated successfully and now we can go back to our dashboard and if i visit this website in a new tab there is nothing special we only have a logo and this hello world post now let's see how we can get that demo data so for that let's go back to our dashboard and under appearance you will see import demo data just click on that and this is the theme so you can see there are a number of demos available for the home page almost 17 so you can pick any of these and you can check them by clicking on preview demo and let's say i want to use this one so i'll click import here don't select any of these and you can click on continue and import and this will start importing content so this will be dependent on your hosting and internet speed let's wait for this and import complete so we can visit our website to see how it looks and there we go so we got the home page all the jobs categories featured jobs testimonial and so on now let's scroll up and uh, let's find out we have all the home pages all the pages for the jobs employer candidate blog and these pages so this was how you can get the superior theme and how you can set this up 
now this theme can be customized from three places one is to go to customize to make changes to the main parts and then you can go to themes option to make changes to the themes option and obviously you can use elementor for editing the pages and i'm not going to cover everything in this video this was just to show you that how you can set up this theme if you want to learn more about wall face and elementor you can just go to my channel and here you can see i have lots of videos about wall face and elementor where you can learn how you can customize the theme using elementor and in order to make money from this website is you can charge employer and candidates for each sale you can get a percentage on each sale so i hope the video will help you and still if you have any questions about this video you can ask in the comment section thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next